Alright, hello everyone, and welcome back to another video. Uh, today I'll be hoping, hopefully uh, putting back together my little 50cc quad. Um, I've got a few plans for it, for what I want it to be able to do around the property for me. Um, and I've had the frame for ages, and originally I put the 50cc motor out of it in my trike, but then I found that $20 motor from the tip, put in that, so I had a spare motor, so I thought why not put the quad back together. Um, I want it to be able to just take me around the property real slow and um, carry my crawler on the front, so that I can just go out crawling by myself. Um, but I've just, I've run into a few problems with the wiring and stuff, because um, this is actually the wiring loom that come with that tip motor. And somebody had a really good go at playing with it. Um, so I've had to add in battery cables and stuff. And cut wires that don't need to be there. And now you just have to basically hotwire it to start. So I'll put a switch in there later. But at the moment, I, I last year I had a, a major problem with this. I put it back together and I broke my ankle. Uh, it... It went underneath there and the uh, sprocket grabbed it and ripped it around and did it really good. Um, so hopefully I don't want to do that again. So I'm going to actually cut the frame down here and up here and lengthen it so that you can fit your foot in between the wheels. Um, and then I'll just bend the foot pegs forwards a bit so it's still in the middle of the wheels and put a bar to the back chassis so that you can't get your foot stuck in the wheel. And then, it'll be good. So, I guess I'll just get on and do that. So I've got the frame chopped in half now, and I don't actually know how much I want to lengthen it. So I'll have to just get some measurements to see what'll fit. But uh, I don't know, I reckon like a 100 mil or like a 130 maybe. That'd, that'd be enough, surely. An extra 130 mil next to your foot, that's like, that's like half a foot. I should do it. I'll go 100, 120 mil. I'll cut my 120 mil spaces and put the quad up on timbers and stuff to try and get it facing level. And I mean, it looks pretty good. It's going to be so much longer. Probably didn't really need to be that long, but safety first. And if the quad, if the 50 doesn't have as much power as I want it to, I can always put the 125 in it. And the, the trucks. I need, I need more wheels. I need to get wheels from somewhere. But until then, we're, we're going with 120 mil spaces. So I did decide to remove the motor because it was in the way. Put it over there. Um, and I've gone around and cleaned up where I'm going to weld in most of the spots and I'm just about to set it all back together and tack the bits of tube in place and it should be good
So I just finished welding all the brackets and gussets and everything onto the frame. All the welds look pretty good. The ch chassis is pretty straight as well. Got it reasonably good. Uh, I'm actually pretty proud of the inside welds. I thought I did pretty good on most of them. Especially one down the middle. But we currently just lost power. So I, the generator's running in the background. Which is why I'm doing a voiceover. Well, I finally put pretty much everything back together, uh, apart from the seat and everything, but I don't actually have one, so my mum said she'd make me one. Um, got it got it to run finally, had to make a custom starter motor switch, took us ages because uh, I kept soldering the wrong wires together, the wrong plugs that just go to nowhere, the original electric start button, doesn't exist anymore with using original parts but it starts it take it takes quite a bit of convincing um, I don't really know why but we think it's just because the starter mode is old and it's always had a problem with trying to start on electric start but yeah I'll show you I'll give you a demonstration somehow Anyways, that's gonna wrap it up for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um, if you want to see more, be sure to uh, like and subscribe. In a future video, I'll make a seat for it. Hopefully, get it to run a bit better. But, anyways, thank you very much for watching if you got this far. And I guess you'll see one of my other videos. Yeah.